What's up guys, in this video I'll be showing you as how to install Android L on your Nexus 4 devices. Uh, the current version that I am running on my Nexus 4 is Android 4.4.4. .4. Now for this method to work, there are two steps that you need to follow. The first step is that your device should be rooted and the second step is that you should have the latest recovery that is a CWM or TWRP and I'll be providing the files in the description of the ROM that you need to download. Do check out the description and download the files and also you have to download the Super SU uh, latest update version of Super SU and I'll be also providing the link in the description for Super SU also to download the ROM and the Super SU file so after that you'll be good to go now you have to switch off your device and uh, you have to go into the bootloader mode as you can see i'm just switching off my device so as you can see now your device has been switched off now for going into the bootloader mode you have to press the volume up volume down and the power button simultaneously at the same time so that you'll be taken to the bootloader mode i'll be just doing it and you can see you have been taken into the bootloader mode now go into re recovery mode as you'll be taken there you know, TWRP and uh, now I'll be zooming in you can see I have installed the latest TWRP recovery on my device so no, to be noted you should have the latest recovery installed onto, the, onto your device and uh, now what you need to do is you have to just uh, back up your device in case if anything goes wrong you can again restore it uh, for your convenience now you have to go into the wipe section and uh, just slide swipe to factory reset go back again go back and uh, go to the option as install and uh, go down scroll down and you can find the file as android 5.0 uh, AOSP R4 Nexus 4 dot zip selected and this is the gap in, in this ROM gaps are also G apps are also included so you don't need to install the G apps separately for this ROM so as you can see it's now getting installed And uh, as you can see, it will prompting you a message uh, call as uh, the, the ROM has been successfully installed onto your device. Now just uh, select the reboot system. And you can see your uh, device will be rebooted. Now do note that uh, after installing the Android L ROM on your Nexus device, uh, your root access will be broken. So again, you have to go into your uh, bootloader mode, go into the recovery mode and uh, select the update as you uh, super, super user dot zip. So this might take around like uh, five minutes of time. So don't panic, just sit back and relax and uh, let the Android lollipop do its work. Now as you can see the android logo has appeared and uh, let's set up the device here skip it and As you can see, Android L on a Nexus 4. Now I'll be showing you the version here, and uh, you can see the version is the LRX21M, and uh, this is the Nexus 4 phone. As I'll be zooming it a little bit more, you can see here. Now let's go and see if the Wi-Fi is uh, working or not, uh, is in working condition or not. Let's go to Google Chrome, and. Uh, uh, let's go to YouTube. As you can see, the Wi Fi is working perfectly. And uh, now let's go to the camera and see 
whether the camera is working or not. You can see the camera is working. Uh, now let's see the video if the video is working or not. So as you can see the video is also in a good working condition. Now uh, let's go into the settings option here and uh, let's go into display and you can see adaptive display is also there and ambient display. Now your device should be uh, rooted and as you can see when you install this Android L ROM uh, your root files will be gone as you can see your device isn't rooted now what you need to do again is that you have to go into the bootloader mode again and uh, as I have said I have provided the second file that is super su file uh, provided by chainfire uh, you have to uh, flash that also I'll just going in and uh, go into your install option and I'll just zoom in a little bit more. Scroll down, and you can see update super su 2.16 zip is available. Just uh, tap on it, and you can see uh, just swipe to confirm flash. And just select the option as a reboot system. As you can see you are in your system now just go back and check again whether your device is rooted and you can see your device is rooted so through this simple and easy procedure you can install Android L and also root your Android L device running on your Nexus 4 so hope you guys like the video find the video helpful please do comment subscribe hit the like button and also do subscribe me for more tech related more ios and android related videos on my channel uh, and also do follow me on facebook twitter instagram and google plus till then i'll be seeing you in my next video